Hi, this is Ayana and welcome back to my channel. Yesterday, I went to Uniqlo to get two items from the collaboration with JW Anderson. The first item is this basic white shirt and the other item is this rainbow colored pattern 17 spikes hippie dress. So in this video and next video, I will do some stylings with these items and in this video, I'm gonna show you some looks with this white shirt. I think you can copy my styles with any other plain shirt you own. So I hope you enjoy my video and get some inspiration for your styling. So this is the most plain look with the shirt. I wear a pair of black skinny pants, the white socks, and the black flash shoes. The length of the shirt is long and almost reaches to the middle of the thighs, so it goes well with the bottoms which makes your neckline look sharp. To make my most basic style, I add the black leather jacket. And I literally wear this more than 100 days a year. It can't go wrong with any styles, especially when you choose black and white. For the second style, I'm not sure how it's exactly called in English, but I put a sleeveless navy knit jumper over the first style. When you layer some top top over the long shirt, it creates higher waistline and makes your leg look a bit longer. Since the neckline of the knit vest is pretty high, I wear the long necklace to create V-line. And putting a bellet also allows you to look taller and gives some spices to your style. For the next style, I wanted to do a kind of one-tone coordinate, but I don't have a pair of very white trousers, so I choose just linen pants as it still has similar color tone. This time, I tucked the shirt in the pants, and this is actually my favorite point of this shirt from Uniqlo, that it looks quite nice with both tucked and untucked. To complete this beige tone style, I put a very long trench coat which is hand me down from my mom and she wore it when she was at my age. I think adding the long outer is always one of the easiest way to do some fashion bloggerish style. For the first style, I wore the shots as an outerwear and tried to make some casual style. The red line on the socks matches the striped t-shirt well, and light blue color of the jeans is just a result of me having worn it more than 6 years, but it actually suits to the white color and brings the whole looks together in the end. This is the last look for the video, so I choose to do some scalp look. If you mind the big white space on your body when you untuck the long shirt, one of your options is the style with the long skirt, as it gives another layer to your style and prevents the eyesight centering to the white part. I thought my skirt was a bit shorter than the ideal length, so I wore a pair of pink socks to fill the blank and tried to keep a good balance. Putting a scarf around your neck is another good way to create a point to get attention, which covers up the emptiness of your white shirt and avoids getting bored with your style. And anyway, the combination of a white shirt and a scarf always gives me a good vintage vibe, which makes me want to do something like picnic with the basket. You know, that's all we need to do in spring. <laughs> 